It took 19 years for Joe Bidelke Peterson to politicise and use the Queensland Police Service as a paramilitary extension of the government. It has taken Campbell Newman uh, less than 24 hours. Yeah, we're going to march across the Parliament House because we're very, very concerned about what happened this morning. We want to be able to see the Premier of Queensland and we want to tell him face to face what he's done wrong here today. January this year we, we gathered from across the five hundred nations uh, and came together in Canberra to celebrate the 40th anniversary of the Aboriginal 10 Embassy. Our leaders and elders from across those five hundred nations made a decision to extend a network of Aboriginal sovereign 10 embassies. There are Aboriginal 10 embassies right across Australia to educate the broader community about the importance of Aboriginal sovereignty, about the importance of Aboriginal land rights. In Brisbane, we decided to set up the 10 embassy in Musgrave Park. We have gathered there since time immemorial, since the beginning of the dream time. Two months ago, we came together on that place. We made the sacred fire. And this is a very important point because we had coals from the original sacred fire in Canberra to start our branch of the sacred fire there in Musgrave Park. The trade union movement came in and they helped us erect uh, fencing around around the tents so that uh, Penny Erie could, could conduct all their activities and we would not pose any, any threat of disturbance. This was a peaceful protest. We're not causing any problems to any other person. We certainly weren't going to cause any problems to the Penny Erie Festival. We came here to assert our rights as Aboriginal people. The police closed off all the, all the uh, streets. The police forcibly removed the, the media representatives who were there. 300 heavily armed police with, with Glock 9mm pistols, with uh, taser weapons, uh, with the full right business all there to, to come down upon a, a small group of Aboriginal men, women and children and our white supporters. The police, they're wearing their, uh, their motto which is, with honour we serve. They are serving the very selfish, very political interests of, of people like Campbell Newman who are so ready to, to get into bed with uh, the big end of town, uh, the big business people, to start exploring ways and means of expanding the mining industry, even using far more of our, of our valuable food producing land in order to, to build up this uh, coal seam gas industry. People of Queensland should be very alarmed. Aboriginal people and our non-Indigenous comrades and friends need to stand together on this and, and oppose Campbell Newman in the same way we all, all, came, all came together to confront the Joe Bidelke Peterson administration. We saw Joe trying to close down street marches in the mid 70s. We saw Joe uh, use his, his uh, thuggery, his brute political thuggery. It took 19 years for Joe Bidelke Peterson to politicise and use the Queensland Police Service as a paramilitary extension of the government to assert a corrupt and rotten uh, political agenda. It has taken Campbell Newman uh, less than 24 hours. Once we had made sure that uh, at 35 brothers and sisters who had been arrested uh, were OK, we, we then marched on Parliament House. We're asserting our rights as Aboriginal people. We're asserting our rights to have a peaceful protest. And we're certainly asserting, going to assert our rights to march across the Parliament House. Because we want to front this, this grubby little Campbell Newman, but, but uh, Murray people now call him Gammon Newman. Gammon because he, he lies. And we had a very strong but very peaceful rally there outside the Parliament House. 89 members of the new Parliament, not one single Aboriginal and Torres Strait person sitting in that Parliament. Aboriginal and Torres Strait people across Queensland are hostages to a, a corrupt and rotten political system in which we have no participation and over which we have no control. Uh, we, we thank all our comrades and friends uh, for their support. The ACTU Congress had uh, interrupted proceedings and moved this motion of support for the for the Aboriginal Ten Embassy in Brisbane. And we were we were so pleased that uh, that motion came through. This struggle will go on, and, and we will put uh, our sacred fire back to its rightful place, and we will re-establish our Ten Embassy in its rightful place uh, in coming weeks, in coming months. Uh, the, the 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 spirit of Musgrave Park will will be given back to the place where it belongs. Whatever land you walk upon on this country is Aboriginal land. It has, it has an ancient and powerful spiritual history, an ancient and powerful spiritual echo. 